Hi there, my name's Andy Hillier, and today's guitar lesson is going to be on Country House by Blur. It's a great tune, I'm going to teach you the whole song, but just before I do, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video, press the notifications, and I do love to hear from you, so please leave me some comments in the comment section, let me know what you think of the song, let me know what song I should do next, and if you love what I'm doing, you want to support me, support the channel, and you want to print the tabs off for this, then I'll put them on my Patreon page, I'll leave a link to that in the description. My guitar is in standard tuning. Okay, so the intro sounds like this. So to play that, we've got an A chord. First finger on D2. Second finger on G2. Third finger on B2. Playing from the A string downwards. And for the rhythm, just go like down, down, down. But if you can, just play the bass note, so like the A string on this one, and then play the rest of the chords. Or you could just do three downs. The next chord is an E chord. First finger on G1, second finger A2, third finger D2. Same idea on this, um, you can play the top string twice and then the chord, or hit it three times. So the first bar. We then go to a B minor in bar two. First finger A2. Second finger on B3. Third finger on D4. Little finger on G4. Middle four strings, that's B minor. And that lasts for the whole bar. The other two only lasted for two beats. So when we're gonna do it, we're gonna go down, 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 down. We then go to a D chord. Second finger E2. First finger G2. Third finger B3. Playing from the D string downwards. So. Then a strange chord. You could just play an A chord here but ideally you want to play an A slash C sharp, which is your first finger flat across D2, G2, and B2, and then your third finger on A string at the fourth fret, so A4, that note is C sharp. So it's an A chord with a C sharp as the lowest note, or as the root note. Okay, so we've got... And then the last chord is a C sharp chord, so you put your first finger on that a4, and third finger across the D, G, and the B strings at the 6th fret. And that's C sharp. And that lasts for the whole bar. So, so you've got A for two beats, E for two beats, B minor for four beats, then D for two beats, A slash C sharp for two beats, and then C sharp for four beats. So the intro goes... So that's the intro, that goes straight on to the verse. Now, you'll notice the first four bars of that verse are exactly the same as the intro. A, E, B minor, D, A slash C sharp, and then C sharp. And it basically plays that again, so you repeat it twice in the verse. But you'll see above bar number eight, it's got a one and a dot. That means the first time you play that. And then on the repeat, you play bars five, six, seven but don't play bar eight, instead you jump onto bar nine, which is the same chord, the C sharp, but this time it only lasts for two beats. And then we go to an E chord for two bars. Okay, so hopefully that makes sense. So you play bars five, six, seven, eight, repeat and play five, six, seven, jump to bar nine, and then play bar 10 and 11. So let's just play the second time through. So we're gonna play five, six, seven, miss out eight, Go on to bar 9, 10, and 11. Here we go. Three, four. Uh, that takes us to the chorus. Now the chorus sounds like this. Okay. 
Okay, so for that A chord, and we can do like a rhythm down, 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 up, down, up, down, down. Then the next chord, you've got a choice. You could play a normal E chord, or if you want to, like I've written here, add your little finger to B3, and that creates E7, then bar of D, and then bar of that A chord again. And then it all repeats. So you get this. Okay, so that's the chorus. Um, it then goes back to the um, verse and then chorus. And then at the second chorus, on that last bar, bar 15, um, on the repeat, you only do two beats of the A, and then it goes on to the next line where it does an E chord. It's like a bit of a build, uh, an E chord for two, sorry, three bars. So you got. Okay, so just go down, 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 down in each bar of that E. Um, then we go to the solo, which is the same chords as the intro. So you get. And that repeats bars 19, 20, 21, 22. And then after the solo, we get the little breakdown part where we're just playing uh, E, oh sorry, A chord first, then E, then D, then A slash C sharp, then to A, then E, then D, then A. And don't put any rhythm in that, just play each chord once. It then goes to the chorus, and keeps repeating the chorus till the end of the song. Well, I do hope you've enjoyed that little guitar lesson. If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video, press the notifications, and I do read every comment, so please let me know you're watching out there. Just say hi, or just let me know what you thought of the video. Uh, let me know where in the world you're from. Let me know what songs I should do next. And if you love what I'm doing, you wanna support me, support the channel, and you wanna print the tabs off for this, then I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. Well, thanks for watching this. I do appreciate it. I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time.